Now, is this the world's cutest condiment packet or what? Little Spice packing a lot of punch. Oh yeah, I found this recently at a gas station. I just thought it was too cute. I had to share it. Anyway, um, yeah, a happy Monday to everyone. Hope everything is going well in your guys' world. I'm on an assignment today. I'm actually out here on Cleveland's east side meeting up with a person to interview them in a public venue. And it's kind of weird sometimes to go and interview people not in their homes. It's not that uh, people don't trust us. It's just happened to be a convenient place for you know me and this other person for the story so it just worked out this way but uh yeah we, we meet up with people in some of the weirdest places and an interesting little tidbit is that sometimes we'll call people for a story and we're like hey we want to interview you we want to do something you know about you about an event about whatever and some people just aren't comfortable with opening up their homes and that's totally okay totally legit but you know then they offer they're like well why don't we meet up at you know this coffee shop or this restaurant or whatever it's a great idea it's a great notion but it's always a challenge because unless it's a uh, like a local or a small business most likely we won't be able to go inside there because if we're inside of a restaurant chain or something there are lots of rules in the media and not that we can't go there and not that we couldn't get permission it's just you have to go through a lot of loops a lot of uh, hurdles to get to that area to get access to the area so out here Cleveland's east side out in a public venue I'm not I'm not concerned about anything in terms of where I'm interviewing right now but um gosh the, the little things we do to get the story right so I got a really cool story about a woman who she bought this item when she moved here to Cleveland decades ago and get this within probably the past week or something she found something hidden inside of that thing she bought I'll tell you what it is what she found what it could mean it's pretty exciting I am oh I can't wait to see it I am so stoked but um and the great part is this lady so excited so enthusiastic on the phone so I know she'll be a great interview so it's like a double whammy plus here so anyway happy Monday to everyone I can't wait to wrap things up here and then I'm off to bowling league that's right my first of two for the week I have two bowling leagues that I'm involved in love going to them my favorite thing is meeting up with some of my gal pals at league and uh, you know there are a few of us that are young and happening but I think everyone at bowling league is happening whether they're in their 20s or in their 60s you know we, we all go out we have a good time it's it's just a fun sport to be involved in but anyway those are the things that I'm doing today I hope you guys are having fun and if anything I mean wasn't this a cute little spice packet right Tabasco who would have thought anyway happy Monday <laughs>